On today's Beauty Talk, my guest is the lipstick queen herself, none other than the fabulous Rita Ora. So obviously the red lip is your signature look, so what's the secret to the Rita red lip? It makes your lips just juicy. I mean, every time I saw a red lip on any female, whether it was Marilyn Monroe or my mother, I always just saw them in a different kind of light and it made me want to be glamorous. Beauty and glamour is what women have as power and I, and I like to use that power, so... It's more than just a red lip, it's, it's like me. Beauty wise, what do you pack? Moisturising cream and a face mist. Oh, I, it's essential. I always have to refresh Which my makeup. Do you like? I use that um, MAC refresher. The other signature that yeah. you have is your hair. You know, yeah. the blonde. I mean, what is it about, you know, for you being blonde? Well, I'm naturally a brunette. So yes. for me, a blonde is a massive difference anyway. What do you put in it? Do you put like, do you have a specific I've used everything from food to like olive oil, to even beer, because apparently beer helps you like close the ends. So you love nail art. Is this what you're into right now? Is it like a gingham Yeah, it's not like a monochrome thing, but I honestly didn't know what I wanted to do today with the nails. I just saw a really nice kind of sample of all these things, and I wanted it to just be as monochrome, but as detailed as possible. Today's shoot was about being detailed and being really sexy and effortless. I want to talk to you about your collaboration, your new perfume collaboration Yay. with DKNY. Have you always loved fragrance or is this something new? The perfume world is new for me, but uh, smelling good is really important. I mean, as you can see, everything that I'm doing that we can do to decorate as a woman, like nails, smell, hair, makeup, clothes, underwear, everything I use. I use the tools that we get given, you know what I mean? So for me, doing a perfume was kind of the next step to being fabulous. Did they kind of say, right, here's a few samples and you got to kind of choose what you liked? They explained the concept, you know, my and why being about New York mm. and it having to be the city in a bottle. And that's where it came from. And I was like, ooh, because you know, New York for me is a really special place. That's where I, you know, went into the studio for the first time. That's where I got signed. That's where things happened for me. It made sense. And it was a young, fresh fragrance and it smells awesome and the bottle is awesome. And you know, there was no reason for me not to do it. Do you yeah. wear fragrance when you're on stage? Yes. yes. It, my ritual is I sip tea, listen to music, reapply my lipstick about 17 million times and then I spray perfume on. I feel like it's my responsibility when I'm on set to give people motivation. You've got to make sure everyone's comfortable so they work to their best. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank, Thank, you. Thank you very much. <laughs> you remain quiet the whole time. I'm really proud That's of you. That's amazing.